Hello everyone, here is a beautifully presented bore gauge by Intast of Germany, similar to uh, Diatest, which is a more popular name known. Box is in very nice condition, and inside we have the gauge. It's simply a dial indicator with an extension tube and various uh, split ball anvils to attach to this extension tube. All the components are beautifully made. Really nice piece of engineering. Here are the gauges, the ring gauges or setting rings. One for each of the split ball heads. They're all in very nice condition. I've also included a Mitutoyo IDC Digimatic so I can then convert imperial to metric measurements and thus extending the range that this uh, split ball gauge can have in today's machining. You can see there I'm just uh, operating it. Set the dial to zero, a little bit difficult with one hand. The yellow tolerance markers there are adjustable and the dial is marked plus or minus. And there you see a little lifting lever on the side of the gauge. Let's change the split ball. Inside is the small uh, pin, lifting pin. We put on the largest head. Very simple to do, as you can see there. Give it a tighten, and it's good to go. Because the gauge is in imperial measurements, a lot of people won't be able to use it simply because we're all metric nowadays. But what I'm doing here is I'm just putting on another head and I'll take out the intast dial indicator here, just loosen off this nut, which has a uh, collet, uh, expanding collet sort of a grip. And I can insert the Mitutoyo, which has the same shaft diameter or stem diameter. So once I see, there we go, the uh, indicator moving, it means the rod is now engaged. I'll tighten that up. And I can set the, the gauge now to zero. But the IDC indicator has some great features to it, which adds to the versatility of this set. It also measures to one micron, which is a higher accuracy than the included indicator. And you can see there, I can convert between metric and imperial. Check out my website, lloydstuff.co.uk, and follow me on Instagram, at lloydstuff.